hello everybody hi Arias <laughs> well look at me driving my own car it's Saturday today and I've basically been in isolation like pretty much all week to be honest although I took myself out a walk yesterday I'm actually on my way out a walk at the minute I'm going to be meeting up with Kyle not too sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing but I'm going to be in my car and he's going to be in his car and we're not going to be like around each other so I don't know we're just going to be meeting up and taking it from there really but we're always going to be like, keeping our distance and everything so I thought I'd take you along with me you know and I really do hope that my camera um is okay the way it's sitting because I literally have it strapped to my dash with tit tape like boob tape <laughs> you know like that double sided tape I just got it off pretty little thing um or was it eBay no I think it was pretty little thing um but yeah off we go <laughs> yeah, it's honestly such a nightmare to try and like reverse out of my drive so let's do this Oh, that was close. It is such a nice day and this is something I was thinking about earlier like it would be so much more shit if it was such a rainy day and we were stuck in the house so at least whenever it's like really nice weather you can go out and sit in your bag or you can take yourself out in your car and like go a walk and distance yourself or go a walk with somebody that's actually like in your family or something like it would be so much worse if it was really like shit weather and raining and we'd be so much more miserable but oh well. I think I might actually need to put my sunglasses on because I know I have my wee my wee visor thing but I'm honestly that small that it doesn't it doesn't do anything. Okay so we're all good now to have a wee chit chat. <laughs> I have my sunglasses on because honestly the sun was absolutely blind to me. Just on my way to Garva at the minute to meet Kyle so we're just meeting each other halfway. He lives just in between Magra and Magrafil and I obviously live in Korean. If you're not from around this area you'll have no idea what I'm talking about but whatever. I think I might just like stay in the car and everything and just keep just keep it pretty safe to be honest but I don't really think that we're doing any harm just meeting up with each other and staying in our cars if that makes sense so so these sunglasses I'm wearing I actually bought these to go to Vegas so since I'm not for Vegas anymore I thought I may as well get my use out of them now <laughs> um, I actually got them on Boohoo I think they were only like literally about two or three pounds I really hope my tit tape is uh, holding my camera up nicely <laughs> It's honestly going to feel so weird tonight not going out anywhere because I do not know about anybody else but see on a Saturday night I cannot sit in the house. Even if it's going out and sitting in somebody else's house I'm fine but I just cannot sit in my own house on a Saturday night. If it's just me and Kyle and we're planning on having like a night in and bringing a takeaway in and we're going to have a movie night with like munchies, ice cream, all that good stuff I'm fine but oh no. <laughs> See, sitting in on a Saturday night, it absolutely kills me, so I have no idea what we're going to be doing tonight. But there he is, there. So we were meeting up in Garva Forest and it's closed so we're literally now just parked at the side of the road. Mummy had said to me that she thought that um, Garva Forest would have been closed. Will I go in front or do you want to go? Uh, you go first and then I can follow you. Alright, uh, this is just going to be a guessing match. Okay. Right. Right, can I hurry up and get out in your car so we can go, Luck? Like. Shit, sure, I didn't even have my handbrake on. Last week, and I haven't even given her the money yet. 
So, this is our situation. <laughs> windows up and all. Well, we had the windows down, but... <laughs> So this is basically me home now guys, so I'm not too sure whether I'll be speaking to you the rest of the evening, but if not, I'm sure I will see you either tomorrow or Monday, and I'll probably take you along with whatever I'm doing during the week, so I shall see you then. <laughs> Okay, so I thought I would just show you what I use to clean my makeup brushes. So I just use this wee matte from Sigma. And then I also use this to actually clean up my makeup brushes. So it's the 2-in-1 Bold Gel from Lenore. And this is obviously just to clean your clothes. But I actually got this idea from Chloe Morton. She's here on YouTube. Um, but I just find that this is really, really good. Especially for your foundation brushes and your concealer brushes. I'm sure you know that trying to get foundation and concealer off your brushes is so, so hard. But using this makes it so much more easier to actually clean your brushes. And it just leaves them so, so clean. Obviously, you need to give them like a really good rinse and everything. But... It works so, so well. I suppose he's fond of his food. Who is? Garn. Yeah, he is. Yeah. Uh, yeah. Adrian was here. There you are. Adrian is here. Oh my goodness, there's coriander on my camera. Ew. So that is me. Just finished dinner and we are now going to go for a walk. And because my hair looks so gross i think i'm gonna put my wig on so yeah we'll see <laughs> you were in that. I don't even know what day it is. <laughs> I think it's Thursday and I'm literally just awake and it's like 12 o'clock. Well, no. It's quarter past eleven, and I'm going to have some breakfast, and I'm going to have pizza for breakfast. This pizza is supposed to be cheese, ham, and pineapple, and there's not one bit of pineapple on it. more cheese on it as well. Yeah.
show me the mix. And the nibbles as well. Ooh. And the nibbles. <laughs> Do you know, I'm not even going anywhere. I'm just sitting in my car for the sheer hell of it because I miss going places. <laughs> so yeah, guys, I think I might actually just end this vlog here. But I thought I would just come out into the car. Oh, I actually came out into the car to have a smoke, actually. Um, although I have to say, like, even though I do smoke, I hate smoking in my car and I will not let anybody smoke in my car. Oh, but it just cracks me up. But see, at the minute... I don't care. Like, I really I do not care. Um, but anyway, as I was saying there, the reason I thought I would come out and have a smoke and talk to you guys was because I know I haven't been doing like a lot of talking or a lot of anything really in this vlog. And it's because I'm just, I'm literally not in the mood. I have literally no motivation to do anything. I think it was Saturday with the day I was started, when the day I started this vlog. And I was like, oh yeah, I'm gonna be doing this during the week and this, and we'll maybe go through my makeup collection, declutter that, and clean it and sort it out. I don't even know what is wrong with me. I am just not in the mood to do anything. And I do not know what it is. Like with this whole virus thing and isolation and everything, to be honest, it has not affected my life whatsoever. It's just affected me in the fact that Kyle can't come down here and see me and I can't go and see Kyle. That is literally the only way it's affected me. I'm very much an introverted person, so I never leave the house at all. And then obviously I work from home, so I would honestly love to know what the crack is with my camera at the minute. Like, like, that should not be doing that. Like, see the way my hand looks a wee bit funny? It, like, it's... There's something wrong with, like, the motion on my camera. I should maybe do, like, a live video sometime. I don't know. Like, sitting out here in the car or going on, like, a wee drive somewhere and, like, parking up at the beach or something and just doing, like, a wee live chat with you guys. This is actually breaking my heart smoking in this car, I swear. <laughs> I'm honestly... Oh my god, everybody's like clapping for the NHS. Oh, it must be eight o'clock. Oh. <laughs> oh, I feel so guilty. I was like, what the hell is that racket? These naughty neighbours of mine. So basically, if you're not from the UK, we have a health service over here, the NHS, and because obviously this whole coronavirus thing going on, um, and obviously like our doctors and nurses are doing so much and, like through the NHS and stuff, like every Thursday night at eight o'clock, like everybody comes out of their house and claps basically for the NHS and for the nurses and everything, and that's that's what's going on. <laughs> I don't know if you can hear that or not. I really do wish I could literally just sit in here and talk to you all night, but I'm outside freezing and it's April. The joys of living in Ireland. I am freezing. It's freaking Baltic. Yeah. Don't really know what else to say, to be honest. I'm so bored. <laughs> I'm honestly so bored. <laughs> like it's a Thursday night, Kyle usually always comes down on a Thursday night and we're always out walking somewhere or doing something. <sighs> I'm just so bored of being bored because being bored is boring. <laughs> but anyway guys, I shall love yous and leave yous and thank yous so so much for watching this video. Stay safe and I shall see yous later. <laughs>